What's going on, move makers? If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Mariah, and I am a flight attendant for a major mainline airline. All right, you guys, this is my very first three day trip, and I am so, so excited. Oh my gosh, it's so early right now. It's about 3 45. Our flight departs at 5 30, and I am going from Minneapolis to Atlanta, Atlanta to Austin, Texas. I'm a little bit nervous because this is my very first time, but I'm also very excited. So I will see you guys once I make it back to Atlanta. today is day two of my three-day trip you guys yesterday was an amazing amazing first day all of my crew was super nice we worked together the customers were really nice i had no issues it was just such a surreal moment just doing all the activities as a flight attendant and i'm just like wow like i'm actually here and it just felt so amazing. On my last flight though, leaving from Atlanta to Austin, Texas, I did experience my first passenger disruption and I had to write a report. So basically this passenger had got up while we were still taxiing and about to approach the gate. And I told him, I said, sir, you can't get up at this moment, but as soon as we park at the gate, you are welcome to use the restroom. But right now, like you literally cannot get up. And he was just like, well, I really need to go. I need to go. And I was just like, I can see the gate. We're almost there. Just hang on. So I'm looking out the window. He proceeds to get up and rush to the back and use the restroom. So I called my flight leader and I was just telling her what happened. And you know, there's only so much that we can control. If you have to go, you have to go. And so he comes back and everything sits down and I'm just like, you know, it is what it is. We're here. Once we started to actually do plane, I was talking to a passenger who was sitting behind the person who had used the restroom and everything was fine. Like, you know, you're just waiting for everyone to get off the aircraft. And as the guy was talking to me, his elbows and stuff were on the headrest and the guy who had used the restroom turned around and was just saying hey like you're hitting me with your head with your elbow or whatever so basically overall this started a, a argument it wasn't a huge argument but it was definitely a disruption people were just staring they're looking at me to see what i was gonna do and i was just like sir like you know there's no need for this We're like you know everything needs to calm down we're actually deplaning so you know you can go ahead and gather your stuff and get ready to go it was just so crazy for a few minutes y'all like i was just like what is going on but i'm so glad everything eventually calmed down and the guy just left because like it's a fight that it's not worth so i just don't understand like what was the point of it starting anyway and also i forgot to mention that the passenger didn't mean to hit the man in his head with his elbow like if he did he didn't know overall everything else was really well i wrote my first report on my first day but at least i have some little experience with it so if something else happens again i know exactly what to do other than that you guys everything was so much fun me and my friend i went out yesterday got some amazing food got some amazing dessert that dessert was so good and just really got a feel for austin texas i've never been to texas before and it was just a really nice city like I'm excited to come back to Texas. Today, we only have two legs. We are going from Austin, Texas to LA, LA to Nashville, and that is it. We'll be laying over in Nashville today. Nashville is also a great, great city, so I'm excited to see what's going on and check out that food. All right, y'all, so I have a 514 band, and I need to hurry up and get ready to go. So let's hurry up and get to the airport.
what's going on move makers i have so much to debrief you on but y'all like it's just go 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 so i haven't been able to have the time to just sit down and talk with y'all but today i am doing this is technically day four for me even though this is a two-day trip and it's completely different but this is day four i'm just gonna put it all together but you guys i'm going from minneapolis to tampa tampa to atlanta and then atlanta to memphis so not too bad of a day but it's just so much i just talk to you guys so once i get to memphis and i get in my hotel we are going to talk about it Good morning with makers. Today is day five of my trip. Now, originally, of course, it was a three day trip and I had a two day after. So I just combined those. Um, but it is go home day, which is the best day. I only have three legs today. I am going from Nashville to Atlanta, Atlanta to Fort Lauderdale and then Fort Lauderdale back to Minneapolis and then of course you know you guys as a commuter I gotta catch that flight from Minneapolis to Atlanta but I don't count that of course as my flights because I'm just commuting but that is my day today I'm not going to lie to you guys this trip has been whooping my butt because it's so different from what I'm used to. It's been a long time since I've been flying. I apologize up front if this video seems like a little choppy, a little not in sequence. I'm gonna try to put it together as much as possible because I'm just like, oh my gosh, like we'll be running to different gates and you know, all these type of things. And then of course with summer flying, there's just so much more on top of everything that's going on. So I do apologize if you're like, oh, this doesn't seem like a typical video that you be doing yes i know um but it's gonna get better after this because i'm going to get back in the rhythm back in my system and it's gonna be amazing what's going on move makers oh my goodness that trip was insane i had so much fun though i didn't expect to be rerouted i don't even know everything seems like a blur right now i'm currently on a trip it's really just been go 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 i went home that night and i literally felt like i blinked and then i was ready to go back on a trip it was just so quick especially with being a commuter you just don't have that many days off like how you used to because you are now kind of working on your days off and trying to get to your base on your very last off day. But I know this video was kind of like a little all over the place. I was trying to get my bearings, but I promise you everything's gonna get much, much better. Thank you so much though for tuning into this video. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you also subscribe, like, and leave a comment below. And of course, hit that notification bell and check out my social media. And as always, when you make a move, make sure it's for you. I will see y'all next time. Bye. Play